Okay, all right. <coughs> oh, yeah. Check one, two. Um, here's all the... What, what, uh, welcome to my channel. <laughs> this is a... Uh, I'll get the... I need a beer. I need a beer. Let's rock. Yeah, it's pretty good. This is just water. <clears throat> Don't worry. What is happening, guys? My name is Chuck, aka the Crocodile. Wherever you want to put that, I'm the Crocodile. Um, and you're not my dad. <laughs> Welcome to the Croc Crocodile TV on YouTube. Uh, this is my second episode in about a year. So, what do you think about that? Don't care. Today I have a beautiful set of wheels. Um, I have the, the, the front wheel in front of me. They, it, they come in pairs. A beautiful hand polished wheel tubeless by Alpina. Check it out. Check it out! Okay, so if you follow me on um, Instagram, 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 um, you'll know that I have a 2017 Ducati Scrambler Icon. I've put about 6,000 miles on it. I got it when it had about 16 miles on it. Um, so I didn't buy it new, new, but uh, it had the, the little hairs on the tires still and the stickers on the mirror. So pretty much new, but I've been looking for something that could just make it look a little bit more different, a little bit cooler. And I had to check these guys out. Now Alpina has been a company that has been around since 1926. They've been uh, tremendous innovators in how they uh, just the, even the, the detail you just go to the website and I'll, I'll put the description below uh, or right here Um, okay, back to track. Back, back, back on, back on track. I don't know what the f I'm saying. The stock wheels on the Ducati Scrambler are awesome. I think they're great. I, I've always actually liked spoked uh, wheels a bit more. However, that wasn't the option when I was looking at my bike. I know the Desert Sled and some other options do have spoked wheels, but I wanted some. And I'm not a big fan of tubed, tubed wheels. I've always been tubeless. It's just way more trouble when you have to put tube on stuff, so no tubes. As someone who takes photos and posts things on Instagram and does that whole shenanigans thing, um, please note that uh, I take zero pay. I don't like to get paid for anything uh, because I don't want to make it a job, but also I don't really want it to taint my idea of something. And I'm pretty relentless if you might know, like the Bell Eliminator helmet kit. These wheels are impressive. Uh, when I when I actually when I went into the my local motorcycle shop, they're a bunch of old Harley dudes. Um, I, I walk in looking like a total schmuck, um, tattooed boy, glasses, and you know I look like a hipster. Unfortunately, even the the motorcycle shop guys are all classic Harley dudes, just looking at them kind of you know doing, doing the walk up while I'm talking like this and going, oh my gosh, these wheels are pretty. I'm like, yeah, they're they're pretty pretty. I love these wheels. water. Don't worry, it was water. And if you're like me and you might have been looking for something that'd be a bit different, uh, wheels are definitely a huge upgrade. I mean, they're just like, they're, they're, they're the shoes of your bike, literally. Uh, maybe the tires are. Maybe it's like a combo. Maybe the wheels are the feet, the tires are the shoes. Take that to the bank. You're going to be in the ballpark of about 1,680 euros to 1900 euros which in us dollars that's going to be around the two thousand dollar mark give or take like the twenty four hundred dollar mark give or take um if we stop printing money it might actually change a little bit the buying process of these wheels is um, it's seamless their website's fantastic I'm, I'm a bit of a web developer a front-end web developer and do i do a bunch of other crap but 
you know, I'm always kind of picky when I see websites, especially big brands that just have like the worst websites ever. Um, Alpina is, is awesome. It's it's fantastic. You can choose all types of finishes from matte finishes, anodized, uh, the hand polished look right here, which is, it looks like chrome. Um, they got like glossy paint colors. And I know that if you actually contact them, you can actually get a special color yourself or like a two tone or something like that. These guys are actually very uh, able to kind of make what you want to make for your motorcycle. These uh, tires are Continental Conti attacks and these are a bit more street orientated than the TK70 rocks that I have on my bike right now. But I love ripping around on trails, but I also love just going in the streets and just going on roads like a normal pedestrian. So I wanted to be able to have the ability to just kind of switch out wheels without having to like take the hub assembly off and all that sort of crap. So I, I, I spent probably another three, four hundred dollars to add that stuff together. But now I can just like switch my wheels in and out pretty easily. Um, it's not hard to do it on your own. I, I encourage you if you have the slight ability and confidence in yourself to do it, check it out. If not, I'm not a doctor. Go to go to 1-800, go get tires put on your motorcycle shop. For the other one, the other companies that are out there that I've seen, um, that I was kind of looking at, a couple were just like way more money and I, they looked cool, but they kind of looked almost Batman wheels to me or something like that. Like I'm not, or like a, no offense to if, if you're one of these people, but you know, like the stunt riders that like, like their, their bike pretty much looks like a DC shoe, you know, but with a bunch of colors and they freaking do wheelies and stuff. I mean, it's all impressive, but I feel like it, those, the, the other wheels I was looking that were kind of in this it range were like more for that. And I just like the clean pop, um, pretty look, Italian heritage. How can you go wrong with that? Ducati, Italian, Alpina, Italian. It's like, you know, if you're a purist, they, you know, it's, it's like that. Now, as far as customizations go, you got a lot with Alpina. Um, obviously I went with an all like, almost a chrome, they, they look chrome almost. I mean, like they, I mean, check that out. They're pretty much chrome. They're hand polished. However, it's, they're, they're beautiful. When I got them in the packaging, the packaging was like, you don't want to, it's like Gucci packaging almost. It's like, I don't even want to throw that away. I felt like I should have been wearing a kimono and like a glass of wine or I don't even drink wine. Uh, a fancy beer. I don't even I don't like beer. Fancy, a fancy bourbon. I don't know. Something like that. They're, they're just fancy. To wrap this all up for you, I think these wheels for the price that they are, are pretty much unbeatable. They're undefeated champions. Um, when you look at their heritage, what they make, what they do, what they have innovated, the fact that they're tubeless spoked rims, uh, wheel set, the fact that you can change so many different things about them from the nipples to the spokes to the hubs to the colors, the, 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 the textures, all that sort of stuff. But it's, it, it's just so chef kiss. It's, it's chef kiss. It truly is a, a, an Italian, not even, not even like a, it's an, it's a, let's just say it's an Italian, 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 Italia chef kiss. Uh, Muto bene. Muto bene. If you are following me on Instagram, whatever, the subscribe stuff, everyone says subscribe. I don't know why. I don't really give a You can subscribe if you want. You don't have to. I don't care. This is online. YouTube it. It's crocodile. I don't even know what my Instagram, I don't even know what my YouTube handle, I, whatever. It's all right here. So follow the description below. Uh, be sure to follow me on Instagram. That's actually where you're gonna find more of this content is the, the, the pictures and all that sort of stuff. I am very open on uh, my, my personal perspective on the products I use and wear some things. I praise some things like the, uh, the Bell Eliminator helmet. Um, I'm a total uh, hater of. However, I don't think these are gonna be hard to love. Uh, they're impressive as is off my bike, and I'm sure they're gonna be even more impressive on my motorcycle as well. So um, thank you for tuning in. Again, be sure to check these guys out. If you are in the ballpark for looking at them, feel free to hit me up. I, I do my best to, hit, to, to reply back, and I think these are impressive wheels, um, and they're gonna be fantastic. So 
have a good time. Enjoy yourselves. I'll see you on Instagram and wherever else. In Jesus' name, amen.